Sometimes, if we pay attention, nature reminds us to take a break, to pause, to take it slow and breathe. But it's not the easiest thing to do when you are so engrossed in surviving that you forget to just live and do the little things that matter outside of trying to make it. Sometimes, you also need that thoughtful partner to pull the reins and give you that needed reminder every now and then. And I happen to have one of those partners. Now, I know she hates this, but this video is also on Elaine Appreciation Post. So yeah, let me take you on this journey on how we spent 24 hours in this magical Airbnb in the green hills of Abri, a place called The Treehouse. Last weekend was our one year marriage anniversary and Elaine decided to surprise me with what she calls something small. And it really isn't small if you see the kind of thought that goes into her gifts or presents if you've ever received one. So she refused to tell me where exactly we were going except that it was in a brie. And if you know me, if you know me very well, you know that I'm not good with surprises. And worse, driving to a place or driving not knowing exactly where I'm going. I was livid, but I obliged. So I drove up the mountain while getting my instructions in pieces and dying inside every passing minute. But I have to let you know that the road leading to the house or the tree house is an adventure on its own. And I feel that letting you know ahead of you checking it out will be really good. So you know and psych yourself up. When we arrived, I was not only smiling because, ah, Finally, this is it. We've made it. But the greenery and the landscape and everything about the place, just exuding serenity, quickly calmed me down. We arrived to lunch, which Elaine had already pre-ordered. And we immediately, you know, settled into conversations with our hosts who are very, very warm folks. They are really nice. It was kind of like, coming back home after being away for a while. That's how nice it was, or that's how nice they are. We come up the hills and think, wow, this is nice, and then we go off the main road and say, oh no, where are you going? <laughs> so our room was pretty decent, I have to say, with a spacious enough bathroom, it was really nice. And the deck was my favorite part of the whole place where it was facing the woods in the estates. And there's also Wi-Fi for people who um, twitch when there's unstable internet. So <laughs> that's not an issue at all. If you are into plants, you more than love your visit because it's not, you know, only an amazing landscape or beautiful garden, but the hostess is also into the actual business of plants and selling plants. So you're gonna, you know, have more than conversations. Perhaps you're gonna pick one or two up on your way back. That would be really lovely. And I have to say also that the night gets really chilly. It's, oh, the breeze. You don't even need air conditioning unless you're a walking flame. If you're not, then you'll be fine. And the food at Treehouse or the Treehouse is, of course, homemade, very delicious, very fresh. I loved it. And I just loved the whole experience, you know, even though it was 24 hours, it didn't feel like 24 hours. It felt longer, more relaxed, more at home. And frankly, I would say that it was one of my most enjoyed stays anywhere outside home. Would I recommend the tree house to you? That is why I'm here. Absolutely. You should check it out. It's a wonderful place to go. Just kick it and relax. And before I wrap up this one, since it was our one year marriage anniversary getaway, the last activity was to also take a walk at the Brie Gardens where I think we had our first date. This is the place we had our first date ever. I think it was like five years ago, 2015, when we came here and we're young. <laughs> But it was a fun date. We actually uh, got a trotro in Medina and sat next to each other. And we came here, walked through the park. I think later on, we actually came here with a twin and yes. took some pictures as well. We had a pre we had a pre wedding shoot like five years before. <laughs> Our actual wedding. Anyway, so yeah, this is uh, one of the memories and the reason why we came back to this place today. So I'm honored your small beginnings. Yeah, this is the small beginnings, yeah. So, yeah, that's why we came here.
So maybe next time we're going to share some of the lessons we've learned in our first year of marriage. And we also know that a lot of you are looking forward to the house tour video and many others. But in the meantime, hey, take time to cool off the steam. It's very important. And see you in the next one.